Meet Shiva Kumar Singh. He runs a small dealer's shop in the southern Indian city of Pondicherry, a five-hour drive from Chennai. His customers are refrigerator service technicians who buy tools or refrigerant gases from him. Until recently, Shiva Kumar had no idea that the CFC gas, long used by his trade, damages the ozone layer. He had not even heard of the ozone layer. That changed after he attended a training session organized by India's Ministry of Environment and Forests. There he learnt good refrigeration servicing techniques. Shiva Kumar now has a message to his buyers service your equipment well this change is the result of a massive sustained effort. At least 70,000 technicians are scattered across India, each handling hundreds to thousands of aging air conditioners and refrigerators. Many units will stay in use for 10 to 20 years, and if badly serviced, they could accidentally release CFCs into the atmosphere. For a decade after joining the Montreal Protocol, India successfully phased out ODS in the new manufacture of aerosols, foams and domestic refrigerators. In 2003, focus shifted to managing harmful chemicals contained in products that were already in the market or at home. These are mainly refrigerators and air conditioners. Engaging technicians and small business in this trade is essential to any phase-out plan. Training and awareness are components in India's National CFC Consumption Phase-Out Plan, or NCCOPP. It is implemented under the guidance of the Ozone Cell of India's Ministry of Environment and Forests. Technicians are trained in good servicing practices for refrigerators and air conditioners. The NCC OPP envisages a complete phase-out of CFC consumption in India by 2010. Training is designed to help meet this goal. Those who receive training are also supported with the tools of the trade to do a better job. In the end, success will depend on individual actions by thousands of dealers and service technicians. The public can play their part by insisting that their refrigeration equipment is serviced by properly trained technicians. CFC is going to be phased out by 2010 and there are alternative refrigerants which are available. The training has to be given to the technicians as to how you are going to use the alternative, uh, alternative refrigerants. For using these alternative refrigerants there are various equipments. These are newly introduced especially for these alternative refrigerants which, have, which would be coming up in the market. Changing habits and practices is not easy. As with Shiva Kumar Singh, it needs to be done one person at a time. And to meet their compliance commitments, all countries will need to address the challenges of the servicing sector.